Hello, my name is Jean Garcia from ST Microelectronics. I would like to present you the CAN transceivers protection series called ESD CAN, and particularly the last generation housed in wettable flank DFN package. The CAN bus is the most popular communication link in a car, mainly used for intrazone communications in the latest car architectures. As soon as a CAN transceiver is defective, the ECU in charge of a specific function like ABS, airbags, ignition or anything else will not be able to communicate anymore with the domain controller unit or DCU. This generates a defect with a red warning lamp appearing on the dashboard. To avoid this situation, CAN transceivers must be protected with a dual line TVS protection device. This TVS must not degrade the signal integrity even when dealing with high-speed CAN signal. That's why they must have a low parasitic capacitance. STSD CAN series have been developed for this purpose. On top of it, in automotive environment, the CAN lines must survive many transients and wrong connections described in ISO standards. ESD protection, slow and fast transients, jump start and reverse battery, the SD CAN series can pass all these standards. It is approved by car makers and even meets OEM specific requirements about jump start particularly. The digitalization of the car and bedding more features, more computing capabilities and more sensors inputs leads to high density PCB where space and EMI constraints become critical. SOT23 and SOT323 packages are not perfectly adapted anymore to these new smart ECUs. So a new SDCAN device was needed with a smaller package, a better clamping voltage, and no compromise on the line capacitance budget. The new ESDCAN 03-2BN3Y is born. Housed in a wettable flank DFN 1110, the clamping voltage is reduced to 32 volts while keeping the line capacitance at 3.3 picofarads. Highest speed CANFD or CANFD SIC transceivers are efficiently protected in one square millimeter. So if you need only four reasons to choose the SDCAN series, the flexibility of the portfolio covering most of OEM's needs, the integration with the new small DFN 1110 package, the simplification of the design and layout thanks to the low parasitic capacitance and the immunity achieved with the very low clamping voltage and the extra reliability offered by a maximum junction temperature of 175 degrees C. How to select the right ESD can? Simple. Answer maximum five questions around vehicle type, package, can data rate, and jump start to get the right part number. You can get much more information by searching ESDCAN on ST.com.